All right, we are in the parking lot for Nam Tak Tong, which is the sticky waterfall. We're making our descent down to the sticky waterfalls right now. And there's quite a few people here actually. It's pretty nice. It, it is a Sunday, so we will be sharing this beautiful piece of nature with a lot of people. We have a short amount of time here, unfortunately, so we're heading our way back up, but definitely something you should see when you're in Chiang Mai, for sure. All in front of Super excited for lunch. We let uh, our tour guide decide for us, and I'm getting this spicy one. Not sure what it is. All right, so I did take a little taste of this broth already. It's so flavorful. I'm pretty sure it's a tum yum. And the pork is super tender. And you got these little uh, pork balls as well. And uh, chives, you said, sweetie? I, I, was like, I think they're chives, green onion. Yeah, kind of thing. something like green onion or chives it's, and then it's coriander. It's so good, so flavorful. And they even give you a little lime to squirt in it too. Oh, it's so amazing. So we also got these snacks. We pointed them out on the way in. They are flipping delicious. Like I've seen these in Canada before and I've had them and I'm like, man, they're not that good. Thais, I'm sorry, they do it better. And I think Chase and I already know what these are. Maybe we don't, we'll do a little taste test and see. Um, I think they're like the little salty sticks that we've been eating that we really like, but we'll find out. And then I got, I think the same type of soup, but mine is not as spicy as Chase's, um, but the broth is still really flavorful. I squeezed lime in mine. Um, and yeah, again, it has like those, like I think chives. I got mine with pork. Um, it is delicious. Like probably the best soup that I've had here yet. Okay, I'm gonna dive into these sticks and see what they're all about. Oh, they're different, but they're really good. Come on, my soup. <laughs> those are really yummy. Mm. Yeah, they're still really good. The last ones we had were a lot spicier and more seasoning. Yeah, these are more like the same type of thing, but just less of like, I think like the fish sauce, the seasoning, they're more like your regular pretzel stick, if that's what you would call it. <laughs> Shelby has a really good idea of putting them in her soup. That's some crunch. Get these damn sticks away from me. They have okay. like a chocolatey <laughs> inside and they're, they're so good. They're so addicting. We can't stop eating them. So we've just made it to where the Long Neck Tribe is or the Burmese people. Hopefully we get to see one. The ladies use rings around their neck and it's a sign of 
It's a beauty, fashion, something like that. There's a lot less of them here now. They moved back up north. <laughs> so this is how heavy it is. Yeah, very wow. heavy. Wow. And then we'll take it off. You went sleepy. And this is only like half of the size. <laughs> yeah. Do you feel how heavy this is? Yeah. You'd be shocked. Yeah. Whoa. Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> and that's half, yeah. Wow. Here they just hand file. Like everything's done by half, right? Yeah. <laughs> what did you buy, Shelf? I bought a bracelet. Jeez. <laughs> I'm just going towards a, a good cause, so. Yeah, it's, it's kind of sad because this tribe has been affected by COVID a lot, not in the sickness way, but as in a lot of their jobs because of the tourism, they all moved back up north to a different town. So obviously I had to buy a bracelet. <laughs>